Five brilliant facts about broccoli. Number one, broccoli was highly valued by the Romans. The history of broccoli goes back much further than you would think. Like many other vegetables we eat today, broccoli was cultivated from a mix of different plants and then selectively bred to become the vegetable we know today. The Romans adopted many aspects of Etruscan culture including their love for broccoli. Number 2. England called it Italian asparagus. As we know, broccoli is a part of the same family as cabbage, a large family that includes cauliflower, Brussels sprouts, kale, collard greens and kohlrabi. Despite this, when the vegetable first made it to England, it was instead associated with asparagus. In fact, despite being a favored food of the Romans, it seems that it took a long time to spread further than Italy. Number 3. It wasn't until the 1920s that broccoli became common in the US. One of the first records we have relating to broccoli in the US goes back to the third president of the United States, Thomas Jefferson. See, Jefferson had a bit of green thumb and as such he would frequently share seeds with some of his friends over in Europe. One such packet of seeds that he received were broccoli seeds, which he noted sowing at his estate in Virginia on May 27, 1767. Number 4. George Bush banned broccoli on Air Force One. Some people hate broccoli and then there are people that hate broccoli so much that they publicly declare that they never want to see the vegetable ever again. Believe it or not, that man was the 41st President of United States of America, George Bush. Number 5. Broccoli is really good for your health. First things first, if you know how to cook broccoli well, it can be absolutely delicious. The truth is that broccoli is incredibly good for you. So good that the term superfood is quite often thrown around in association with it. It's high in protein, fiber, vitamin C and is a good source of vitamin A, vitamin B6, potassium and calcium among many others. There is no such thing as a bad vegetable but there is definitely such a thing as a bad cook. Thanks for watching.